What's up, everybody? Streaming again tonight. Get in here. Been playing some Tarkin just now. Um, actually, let me go grab my phone so I can talk and chat. Be right back. Hope you guys are having a good Tuesday night. Ugh. Let me just get situated here. Get in the stream myself. Yeah, like I said, I've been playing some Tarkin. It's been going pretty good. Playing some 40th Vader too. But I want to try and keep it, uh, keep, keep the variety going while I can until I get the higher rating. What's up to Sean, Matt B, Lord Havoc, Commander Cody, Michael? No problem, Michael. Yeah, dude. Anytime. I like to help people. Thirteen game winning streak, huh man? Wow. That's pretty good. Yeah, dude, partisan. Really good card. Oof. Bodhi is not fun. Bodhi's like the biggest counter to to um, to Tarkin, I feel, because a lot of my stuff only works against organics. So this might not work out so well for me. Yeah. Wish I had my ATST up. Oh, it's killing me. Yeah, I wish I had net right there too. He's got a little bit of a lead here, guys. It's not unrecoverable, though, considering how that started right there. And he just used his turret, so I should be able to wait that out and then get my ATST going in this lane. That is not over yet. I should have used, um, what's it called, TIE Fighter there instead of my Bladesman. Hold him off. No. No, this is over.
more than likely. Ah, uh, man. Yeah, Bodhi's tough with Tarkin. Good game. You guys are a good player too. All right, let's see if we can play someone other than Bodhi. Believe it or not, I actually had a pretty good win streak going before that. Guys, it's freaking hot. It was like 111 degrees where I live today. It's ridiculous. Luckily, I work in like an office, so I'm like in a temperature controlled area. But Jesus, like going out to my car, I felt like I was going to die. All right, got a Han here. Indiana, huh? My uncle lives in Indiana, in Bloomington. He actually teaches at the uh, university there. But I've never been there. Oh man. Oh no. I definitely could have played that better. For some reason, rocket troopers keep owning me when I'm playing Tarkin. Well, it kind of worked out for him there. Not really. Oh, man. I hope he doesn't take my tower here, boys. That'd be really shitty. <laughs> He's going to beat me, guys. Oh, my God. This is fucking pathetic. No, he's not gonna beat me. He almost did though, holy shit. Whew. I almost blew that. What's up, Epic Lame Explorer? Thanks for the sub. Yeah, I almost blew that game, holy shit. I'm not missing much. Yeah, he said it's pretty cool. He 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 likes Bloomington. I'm not sure what the rest of Indiana is like. 
I know people like to cap on the Midwest, but I've never been there, so I'll I'll refrain. You want me to level up Callus and play Callus? Dang, man, that's some commitment. That's some like put a ring on a commitment right there. I don't know if I want to play, if I like Callus that much anymore. If Callus was a an, a rebel hero, I would totally do it. But 40th Vader is the thing. 40th Vader is really good, and I have him at level three. And I don't know if I would ever want to use Callus over 40th Vader with the current the way things are currently. Because they're like the same hero, except Callus is just not as good. You're trying to play me, Lord Havoc? Oh god, I hope not. I don't need that in my life, dude. Gotta stop them, boys. Get them, Tar. Get them. Alright. That was alright. Yeah, I'll just let him drop a bunch of troops to uh, defend that ATST push and then kill him. Oh, get the stun. Oh, uh, get that stun. Uh, let's go, boys. Well, that was good. Nerve gas is pretty frustrating to play against, I think. <laughs> you see that shit? Especially against Luke, because like Luke's like only move is to just run in and attack you, and then if he gets nerve gas, it's like, well, what do I do? I'm just a Luke. Uh-oh. He's coming for me, boys. Not gonna happen. Might even be able to get... No, not quite enough time here. Um, I don't play Krennic, uh, Lord Havoc. I only have him at level... Um, at level two. I think he's two of four. Yeah, he is in my shop right now, though. I have to get used to actually like checking and seeing what's in my shop, though. Yeah, I could buy one. I could buy one right now and get him to um, get him one closer to level three. But I'm really actually holding out for another Han because my Han is five of eight, and if I can just get three more of those, I'll have level four Han, and then I'll be like. Ridiculous, because I think Han's probably my best hero right now. What's up, Rom? How you doing, man? Welcome to the stream. Seventh sister, huh? I actually made the mistake of trading away a couple seventh sisters like a month ago. And now I'm like totally trying to level her, but she's only level two.
All right, Commander Cody wants me to play Callus. Does anybody else want me to play Callus? If I get two more people telling me to play Callus, I'll level them up and play him. He used to be my main. I used to like spam Callus. In fact, until the the most recent patch where they like changed what your portrait was based off of like your recent play. Um, all right, Matt B, that's one. Hey, be nice, Lord Havoc. All right, that's three people that want me to play Callus. I don't know, guys. I could just play him at level three. Is it worth it? Rom, should I upgrade Callus to level four? I don't. You know what, dude? I don't care. I I don't I don't have as many legendaries as you. Obviously, this would be my my first level four. Uh, legendary. So, it's a big deal to me. See, look, I don't have any level four legendaries. They're all level three. Yeah. I don't know, guys. How about this? I'll actually, I'll play some Callus. I'll play him in my 40th Vader deck. I'll see if I like him. If I like him, if I can stand playing him, then I might upgrade him. Lord Havoc, nobody cares. That shit's ridiculous. That's what... To level six is 30 legendaries, right? Holy shit. I've, look, I've maybe got like 50 legendaries ever. All right, let's see if I can kill this chopper before it disables all my shit. That's the dream, boys. Oh, yep, Chopper is dead. Hey. I play him just like my 40th Vader right there, though, so... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I, I misjudged where he was going to come back right there. Well, I got to be careful, though, because... Hera can take your tower like nobody's business. I think I know how I want to play this, though. I haven't played Kallus in months, by the way. I keep trying to um, sprint around and he does this stupid dash thing. That's another thing about Callus is freaking dash is garbage. Like, n there's no, no, I don't know, I think dash compared to a sprint is really bad. So that's another reason why I much prefer 40th Vader over Callus. Uh oh. He's doing doing hair shit to me over there. Actually the dash worked out well right there because I was able to get on the tower super fast. None of that shit. Whew. That was 
close, boys. Well, I don't know if I played it that well, but... Hey, I beat a, I beat a Hera. Hera's tough, by the way, especially when you run ATST. I think I might switch my deck up a little bit. Um, let's see. I think I might go with that instead. That, and then I think I might go with net over... Um, or riots. Let's see how this works. Yeah, Jerry, I agree. Some sort of like friends function or some way to like communicate outside of your guild in game or do like friendlies outside of guild in game. Like the game is so segregated right now, it's crazy. Or add some sort of like global chat. Like, you know, I don't know if you guys ever played like Blizzard games or Diablo 2 or whatever where you just like join a chat and everyone could just like talk shit on each other in chat before they joined a the game. Like, think about it, if you had, like, a really good win, you could, like, go in a chat and be like, I just beat that fool. Oh, suck it, dude. Or, or something like that. Super Farter. Oh, God. This guy has, like, the cringiest name ever. Super Farter. Who does that? Uh-oh. He's banthing me, guys. Nobody likes to get banthed. It's the worst. But I have net here, so that's good. He didn't get his G and K off on me. Uh oh, there's a chopper coming, guys. What am I gonna do? What I'm gonna do is use an ATST, and now he doesn't have chopper. Ha ha! You've activated my trap card. Uh-oh. I probably should have just played passive right there. I'm low energy and that that dewback's not gonna do a ton. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I thought I got him with my, my thing, but I didn't. It's a disaster, boys. Hey, he didn't kill my tower. I'm absolutely shocked right there, actually. Whew. He's one ability away from using it, though, so what I'm going to need to do is make sure I get... Um, get something going. He just used his chopper, and he knows I'm running ATST too. Oh my god, it's a disaster, boys! It's a disaster.
Well, it comes down to this. Shit, this guy's got level 15s? I didn't even notice. Also, I I am not that great with, uh, what's it called? No. He's coming for me, boys. I can't stop him. He's too buff. No. Good game. So I actually own that guy pretty good with my 40th Vader though. Just so you guys know. Yeah, Jerry, this game's been off and on. Like, it's actually been good today, but I can already feel my tablet heating up, which sucks. Because usually that's a prequel to some lag. Something about, like, I don't know, the game makes it lag worse since the update. So, I don't know. What do you guys think I should do? I could go to one of my good heroes, like my, um, my 40th Vader or my Han. Those are my strongest. I'm also really good with Lando still. Um, go back to Tarkin. What's up, Dicey, man? How you doing? 14 to 15 for commons is or for all cards actually, but uh, 3,000 cards. So you see right there, I'm at 2,700 of 3,000. And more than the cards, it takes 58,000 gold. So that's shitty. I don't know where I'm gonna get all that, the, the credits, I mean, not gold. I'm gonna go back to my Tarkin. Bosk? No, nah, dude, not Bosk. I really like Bosk, but I just think he's so nerfed right now. 17 to 8. So you can get to level 18, Lord Havoc? Is 17's not the cap? Is that what you're telling me? I always thought 17 was the cap. Alright, I gotta play the game, but let me know. Is 17 the cap? Oh, you can't level to, to 18 yet, so it's capped. I have to imagine at some point they'll remove that. Man. My uh, ATS dude did not get that much damage off there, despite the fact that I got nerve gas on all those fools. But I just need little chips like that, and I should win a game where that happens over and over again. Yeah, I feel like I've got my groove back a little bit now with Tarkin. Like, I don't know if you guys were watching the stream yesterday, but my first few games playing Tarkin after not playing him for like a month was rough, to say the least. I, I, I still won some of them, but it was like, I just felt like this was my first time playing this game. That worked out well for me, actually. Look, <laughs> he did zero damage to my tower. Raffle. I just gotta slow push this and he's screwed.
Get out of here, Luke. Get that shit out of here. Eh, stunned. <laughs> this guy's gotta be frustrated. Ah, oh, run! No! Pathfinders, they do a lot of damage. Oh, he's demoralized, boys. Demoralized. Good game. Yeah, dude, it's a little bit laggy when a bunch of stuff... Oh, man, I forgot to open packs. Yeah, dude, it's getting laggy, but only when I, like, um, use a bunch of stuff like uh, Nerve Gas and Dioxys and my special and... And stuff like that. For the most part, it's not that bad. Um, it's it's definitely my game getting laggy at some points, but it's not unplayable. Like the other day when I was streaming with Half Face, it was close to unplayable. I hope they fix it too, like, because I used to not get any problems. Like, I remember people used to complain about that type of stuff, and I'm like, nah, dude, that doesn't happen, and now it, it definitely happens. <laughs> um, all right. I'm on medium quality in the settings, Jerry. Um, I have not tried low quality. Do you think that would help? Let me, let me try that. I feel like I shouldn't have to do low quality. Like, this is a, you know, this tablet is like top of the line, was released like in the last six months. Downloading files? What? You know... But we'll see. You know, if it means better performance, then I'm all for it. We'll see. Luke is training to be a Jedi Master. Thanks for the tip. Chewbacca is brushing his fur. Also, useful information. All right. See if this makes any difference. Oh, congrats, Dicey. Uh, level 4 Jin. that's actually bad news for me. You'll probably kick my ass next time you play me. Congrats anyways, though. Yeah, to be fair, oh man, the graphics are shit now. This will probably be, make a difference considering how shitty it is. But to be fair, this game is pretty complex for a, a phone game. Uh oh, my alarm's going off here, guys. I'm supposed to take out the trash tonight. Oh man. It does seem to run a little bit smoother. Oh, I fucking hate Bodhi when I'm playing Tarkin. He's like, I don't know, a pretty, pretty bad counter, I think. I think I should be able to stop him. 
from counter pushing, so that was a win. Damn. He's gonking me up top there. Oh man, yeah, he got my top tower. I should be able to take this bottom one though, hopefully. Man, how did he have that much energy? That's crazy. Yeah, it's just shitty, because like, Dioxus doesn't work against any of his stuff. Nerve gas doesn't really work against any of his stuff. What am I supposed to do here? Oh yeah, my tower's gone. Uh, this is so tilting. Like, most of my cards don't even work against his his shit. Like, I think the only cards he's running that are organic are towels and pathfinders. Good game. Why do I use Ace Live streaming instead of YouTube gaming? Because every time I start um, streaming uh, with YouTube, oh, I forgot to thumbs up that guy. Sorry, dude. But every time I use uh, YouTube gaming instead of a uh, Ace Live streaming, it like gives me an error code, and it gives me no explanation why. So I've just found that this one works. Yeah, dude, Bodhi's a bitch. All right, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna either play Han or Fortieth Vader now. I'm tired of playing uh, playing my not good stuff. So what do you guys want to see, Han or 40th? Kind of in the mood to play Han. I actually haven't played him at all since Saturday. So I'm actually going to make the executive decision here and play Han. This is my Han deck. I like it. Fuck 40th. Yeah, I kind of agree, dude. But I also kind of think he's the best Empire hero by a good margin right now. So I play him. I guess Krennic is pretty good too. Thrawn's pretty good, but I don't have those guys leveled up. They're both level... Uh, Thrawn's actually level 1 for me. It's sad. And... Krennic is level 2. Go, Bantha, go. YOLO. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So, Dicey, you told me the other day that I could, I could do the X-Wing thing where... It, uh, I just do it from the death, my death. I need you to like walk me through that shit. You think 40th Vader needs to be removed, Dicey? That's, that's a rather extreme opinion. I agree he needs to be nerfed, but he doesn't need to be removed. What's up, Autumn? How you doing, ma'am?
Oh, I'm gonna get that partisan going behind that bantha right there, and it's gonna be beautiful. Go partisan, go. Well, he stopped it. I still think it was beautiful, though. Dead. Good game. I think I played it well. Oh, are you, are you talking about Hera? Who are you guys, which hero are you guys shitting on? 40th Vader or Hera? I don't know what you guys are talking about. I can't read up in the chat. Oh, it's Fallen Empire. Shit. Me and this guy are cool. I actually did a 2v2 video with him like a few weeks ago. Oh no, I don't know if that's going to blow up on the tower. That's not what I wanted. Get him, Partisan! Oh no. No. No repairs for you. Man, I wish I... I'm going to start with Pathfinders, but I wish I had my Bantha. Grr. Stop me, boys. You stop me. But I have my Bantha now. So this push should work out a little bit better. Hopefully. I'm gonna try and space my guys up as much as possible right now so he can't get them all with like Dioxys and, and stuff. It's going to eventually happen, but. Oh, I was one second away. Damn it. He might, he might get a draw off on me here.
We will see, though. Man, that net is irritating. Got him. Good game, Fallen. I actually beat Genocide the other day. Uh, whoops. Whoops. Damn it, I forgot to thumbs up Fallen. That's my bad. I, sometimes I do that. I'm pro Hey Havoc, tell him in Guild that I forgot to thumbs up and I'm sorry. I have to agree with Dicey, 40th Vader is pretty OP. Although, I think a lot of people think 40th Vader is like super easy to play. I don't necessarily agree with that. Like he's, he's easy to like, to play like not well, but to like play him well, you actually kind of have to like, at least go with like a very specific type of strategy in my opinion. This guy's in trouble. Look at that. Big trouble, dude. Whoops. I put two mines right on top of each other. That's not what I wanted to do. Once you get to this point with Han where you're a tower up and you have mines on both sides, it becomes incredibly difficult for your opponent to really do anything. Like, he's going to have to really outplay me here in order to get something done. And I just killed his sniper for free. I'm going to get a partisan going there. Get them, boys. Oh no, they didn't do it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Luckily, I have a mine there. Go, go, go. I can do it. I can do it. Boom. Tower value. Dude, fallen. What's up, man? Hey, fallen. I'm sorry I didn't thumbs up you. It was an accident. I just clicked the OK, but instinctively.
Yeah, I hate when I play somebody that I know when I'm like testing something out, falling. It triggers me pretty bad. I'm actually gonna go uh, take a little bathroom break. Guys, I'll be back in like two or three minutes. I'm back, guys. Was I raging at your healers? Uh, not really, dude. I, I always had the um, the X-Wing up to take care of it for the most part. What, hap what I rage at is if I use the X-Wing and then they use the healer right afterwards. Or if I'm playing against, like, a... Um, like a Tarkin or a Lando that's like cycling super fast to their their repair. I lost Vanquisher. Um, I think I played this guy on his boss recently, or on something recently. Got some bladesmen on the way. He's in trouble there. You know the best thing about net, in my opinion, is it takes a long time for your units to like recover from it. Like if they use a net on your guys when they're attacking, it takes them like a good second to like get out of it. Oh, he tried to use his repair and I got it before. Oh man, he's got to be triggered. I'll give him a lay of face. That poor guy. This guy's a good player, too. I think he's been, like, I don't know if world number one before, but, like, close to it. I've seen him on, like, the top of the leaderboards before.
I'm not even going to commit to a push right now. No need. No need to put myself at risk. He does, he's not running tank or some other unit that can like counter push super hard. And this guy plays really aggressive. Good game. How did my X-Wing not get him? Yeah, he was pretty low. I don't know. I think Bosk has low health, too, so... Props to him for playing Bosk, though. But no props to him for not thumbs up in me. Always thumbs up, people. Salt gets you nowhere in life. Um, yeah, let's keep going. Han is pretty fucking good, guys. Like, I remember when I when I first got, I hadn't played him at all until I got him to level 3, and then I started playing him at level 3, and I was like, holy shit, Han. Han is the truth. He just does so much damage. I don't know what it is. That 40th Vader skill actually got me pretty good there. Nope, I don't want him to blow up my mind. Stop it. But I'm still in a good position here. I'm going to go ahead and drop a Bantha in that lane, even though I know he's tanking over here. Uh-oh, he got locked on. I'm going to like not have to spend any energy to take care of this, though, so that's good. Oh, yeah. Despite the fact that he got the lock on there, I think he's actually in pretty big trouble over here. Yep, he's in trouble. He just, that, that top push right here, there, there did not work out for him at all because he didn't get a whole lot done and he just used a ton of energy. Yeah. 
And that's game. I think, actually. I don't know. He got more damage down there than I thought. For a level 2 40th Vader, this guy gave me a run. Thanks for the sub, Autumn. Can't believe you did. How did you know about my streams if you're not a sub? I thought it, like, sends out a message to subs. Joni Toby, what's up, man? Sorry, I didn't see you uh, post before. Oh, okay, yeah, I was gonna say. Dogs Meat from MMX Awakened. Yeah, that makes sense, Autumn. Das My Guy Yeet 08. Okay. I do not want to meet his uh, do back with my Bantha. So I'm going to Bantha the other lane and bet that I can stop his, his push here with Partisan. Ah, that Sand Trooper up there. Well, well played by him so far. Uh oh, he got the lock on. Mm, I should be okay here. I got the Bantha going on the bottom for the nasty push. Go Bantha, go! Go Bantha, go Partisan! Oh, the Partisan! Oh my god, do you guys just get a boner every time your Partisan does that like I do? It's so beautiful. Like hitting their hero and then like three or four other units at a time, at the same time. Oh, and then just Twi'leks taking that out. I love it. Value boner right there. One energy just took out eight energy right there. Did you guys see that shit? Twi'leks. Oh, here comes the Partisan. Get him, Partisan! Yeah, hashtag value boner, by the way. It's a thing. Man, look at all these salty bastards. I don't think anyone's given me a thumbs up in like four or five games here, guys. 
The Han is just too OP for them. Should I switch it up, guys? Is the Han too OP? Let's see, what rank am I? Rank 35, and I've just gone on a roll. When you Twi'lek things, they just die. So the key with Twi'leks is to make sure they don't have an AoE answer when you use them. So like if they have a Sand Trooper or um, something else that can deal AoE damage ready to attack them, then twi your Twi'leks are going to get owned and they're not going to do anything. But like right there, they had a Bladesman and uh, MTV pushing. I just dropped Twi'leks right on top of them, right as, the, uh, the, right as they were getting in range of my turret. And since the MTV and Bladesman attack so slowly, they can't kill the Twi'leks fast enough. And I just like, between the turret and then my leader and then the Twi'leks, I just kill all that stuff before they can do anything. Use Thrawn. You see the problem with Thrawn, dude. The problem with Thrawn is he is level one, zero of two. I know, it's a problem. If, so if I could take any of my level one heroes and level them up, it would be this guy for sure, but unfortunately I traded him away a long time ago and the luck just has not been with me to, to get more Thrones. Hera and Chopper, get to the Chopper! Um. I could go with my Lando deck. It's very similar to my Han deck, though. I was playing Hera yesterday, and I, I really, really like Hera. I just feel so nerfed because she's only level 2, and then my Chopper is only level 2 as well. And I'm not even close to level 3 on either of them. Callus, I played Callus earlier, Autumn. Were you not here? Yeah, look. If you don't believe me, I'll show you. Look at that. Two Callus games. I even won one of them. If you can believe it. And the other one, the other one was against Super Farter. And he like super beat me. Yeah, dude, you missed it. The Commander Cody or whoever, I don't know if he's still in the stream, but he likes, he wants me to play Callus. You know what, Autumn? I'll play, I'll play another Callus game just for you. Just for you, bro. Why no 9-nub for Lambo, Lando? Because I don't like him, dude. I don't think he's that great. I think, and, and also, mine is only level 2. And, like, all of my other troop cards that I use regularly are level 14 common. So, level 2 unique versus level 14 common. It's not really that close, in my opinion. If I had, like, level 4 9-nub, I might consider it. But I, get, I need to get used to Callus's dash. I'm so used to the sprint, because I play 40th Vader all the time. And of course I play a Luke with, with my Dewback. He's probably running Ben too, like a bastard. Watch, here comes the Ben. Oh, nope, not a Ben. Go, go, go. Let's 
guy's just like letting me win or something. No, this might not work out for me. I felt like I needed to take out the uh, the repair though. I'll just let that loop die. Hmm. Yeah. I feel like this Luke's just not that great. Oh, oh, value boner. Oh, that TIE Fighter. Well, he's not running Ben, so that's good. Yeah, I don't know if I need to run ATST with with this guy. Good game. That was for you, Autumn. You, what's your deck? Do you use net? I imagine it's different than this. I just threw this together. I use ATST in pretty much all my Empire decks, actually, but I don't know. I feel like Callus, like, I want to do is just build up a nice, like, big, slow fighting push and then, like, jump in and AoE and kill everything and then go to the tower, whereas... With 40th Vader, what I like to do is send in the ATST first, and then Dioxus everything, and then run in and kill everything. Yeah, dude, value boner. Hashtag value boner. That's the word of the day. I'm going to go back to Han. Upgrade my Callus. Dude, I don't know if I can do it, man. That's eight legendaries for a, a hero I never use. I have problems. Maybe. Maybe I do. Oh, dude, this guy's tier 10. I'm not going to BM him. That's just mean. Oh, and he's using heavy gunners? Guys, what is going on? What is going on here? I don't know why the game 
matches me up with someone that's tier 10. Like, I honestly feel bad. I honestly do. Like, this guy's not having fun. I'm not having fun. Nobody's having fun. You know, you know the funny thing, Autumn Dash, is I actually remember a game where you beat me with heavy gunners. And I, and I specifically remember it because I was so shocked. You, like, you, um, you were playing Callus and you, like, dropped him right on the bridge on me. And it took me totally by surprise. And you killed me right when you dropped him. And then they walked across the bridge and fucking owned my tower before I was back alive. <laughs> So yeah. Yeah, see this guy's not having fun, guys. He's just not doing it. But seriously, Autumn, I think that is the only game in the history of me playing this game that I've lost to heavy gunners. That is not an exaggeration. They're very strong, but they also die. Any player, you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm gonna give that guy a tower. Cause I'm just, I'm just that type of guy. I'm just gonna let him take it if he can. Come on, dude, do it! I believe in you. Yeah, good for him. Give him a little moral victory there at the end. He'll even probably thumbs up me. Or not. Hey, there it is. That's my first one in a while. Yeah, Matt B, I don't know why um, people get matched against me when they're low like that. This game is cruel sometimes. Like, and those people, like, they might even, like, I don't know. That guy had level 12 commons and was still in Erodium, so he wasn't, probably wasn't the best player ever, but, like, he, he might have been okay, but he just, like, I don't know. There's very few people in this game that can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with me with level 12 commons. It's just the way it is. You know, the funny thing is, I actually played Rutank the other day um, after he'd quit. I think he probably still quit, but he maybe just played a couple games. And he has level 11 commons. And he actually, like, was semi-close to beating me. So that guy's pretty good. A shame he quit. Didn't quite break through there. Not quite, but I'll take it. I don't know why he just sent a frickin' do back by itself. That's not smart. Oh, the partisan value. Get him, partisan. Oh, get him, partisan. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Uh oh. Ma'am, this guy's not making it easy on me, guys. Hmm, can those guys take the tower? It's gonna be close. I don't think so. I think that tower, yeah, I can just kill it with an airstrike right here. Good game. Yeah, Retank played again recently. If you look at my, I think my second to last stream, I play him. I'm pretty sure it was on stream, actually, I don't even remember. And Rue Tank was definitely not chill. That guy was like the opposite of chill, but he was cool and he was a good player. Um, so have I lost a game yet with my Han guys? I don't think so. Let's go, let's go check. Win, 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 win. Win, win, win. Win, win, win. Oh yeah. So nothing but Vs for a while. Han Solo, guys. This is the deck if you want to try it out. It's pretty fucking good. Yeah, Matt B, I, I think, I don't know, I don't really like people that say, like, the game is dead. Like, it's certainly not dead, but it's certainly also not living up to its potential. Like, like, this game should be a fucking sensation. Like, I like it a lot better than Clash Royale, and it's Star Wars, so it has, like, mass appeal. Um, so we'll see if they're going to coincide that all that leaked information, new update stuff with the new Star Wars movie coming out, they'd be really smart to do that and then do like a big marketing campaign for it. But the downside about them waiting this long to like try and promote the game is this type of game necessarily is like not friendly to newcomers because unless you want to spend a bunch of money, there's like no way that newcomers are gonna be able to catch up to people like, like me and probably most of us that have been playing this game for months. Like, there's just no way. So it makes it less attractive to newcomers. So with games like this, and Clash Royale is a great example, you really have to like market the, market the game really strongly out of the gate in order to have it realize its full potential. But I hope I'm wrong. I hope, I hope the game continues to do well because I really like it. Or at least like um, this style of game where it's like um, Clash Royale style with like a, a hero that you can use to run around and kill stuff with, because that's really what makes this game fun for me. Clash Royale felt so passive, you kind of just like drop your troops and like cross your fingers a little bit. Who's this? Galileo Mateo. He's using Sentry Droid. I really think Sentry Droid is going to be like super meta once it's like, once a few more, um, once, it's, once it's been out for a little bit longer, I mean. Because it's like, on paper, that card is buff. I maybe got a little scared there because of his, um, Death Squad Leader. Um, and didn't support my Bantha well enough. But better safe than sorry, I think. This is the type of guy that's going to constantly email me throughout the game. I don't know him, so he's really no reason to like spam emo me. 
but whatevs. All right, so I got my, my Bantha and Death Squad leader going in the same lane this time, which is what I want. I'm glad my mind got that guy right there, actually. Uh-oh, he's rocket troopering me, guys. I think I still have this game, though, actually. Even after that, I think I'm in a good spot. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. He's going to take it, guys. No. All right, well, my, my, last, my last effort right here is to... Uh, just go full support on this push. Which I think I should be able to take his tower with. But this guy's a pretty good player, actually. He's stunning me at all the right times and doing it right. Get it! Yeah! <laughs> you like that shit? Hope you guys watched that game. That was Uber. Woo! Anybody want to give me props for that? That was fucking amazing. Not, not to brag, but holy shit. Who was that guy? Galileo Mateo from Havoc Squadron 6. About the same level as me, other than Sentry Droid, obviously. Let's see, what time is it here? 8.54? Um... Let's see. Give me a wow Lando face. Thanks, Autumn. Appreciate it. Should I keep playing, guys? I'm kind of wearing down a little bit here. I've been playing for a while. Let's see. Rank 24, Rebel Alliance. Look at that. That's pretty high. Right next to Rom right there. Yeah. That's, that's uh, I think, about as high as I've been recently. There was a time a long time ago where I got, like, top 10 for a while. But recently, that's the highest I've been. And I'll keep going. Why not? I haven't lost with Lando yet. Or not with Lando, with Han. Oh, it's Mike Morrow. This, this might be a loss, guys. This guy's. Pretty good, although I think I have beaten him before. I'll give him a good luck. Yeah. I really, really don't like playing against Forlom, like, especially if the other guy knows how to play it well. This shit wrecks. And he's running TIE Bomber, shit. TIE Bomber's really good, like, I think I need to start using it more. Because it feels really strong to me. It's just really good against my strategy of like building up a big push and overwhelming your opponent. Because it's like, oh, you've got a big push. Let me just tie bomber it, and then everything's dead.
Guys, I'm doing it. I'm fucking doing it, boys. Maybe not. He might actually be doing it. Yeah. I think he's doing it, but I was almost doing it. No, Bantha, no. Uh-oh. All right, I've got 35 seconds. I can still take that tower. Yeah, here we go. All right, tie game. I can at least play for a draw here, worst case scenario. See that four long just does like half my hit points in no time flat. This is bullshit. I'm not even gonna try because if he I'm at half health and if he kills me, then it's over. Well, I still haven't lost with my Lando. See you, Autumn. You know, I think I think this might be uh, might be the end of the stream for me too, guys. I'm getting tired. I really got to start going to bed earlier instead of playing this game all night. Um. You know what, what I'll do is I'll play two more games. I'm gonna fill up these packs. I'll play two more games, or at least get two more wins. And then I'll call it. Sorry, Harry. I've been playing for a while. I think this stream's probably like two hours old, which is a long time for me. Strike bomb. Uh oh. You got me, boys. Man. Well played by this guy, though. Actually, outplayed me a little bit there. But I think. Now that I know what he's running and what his strategy is, I should be okay. I had a poor starting hand there too. See, I actually faked to that side right there, so I could go on this side with everything. Uh, 
Uh-oh. This might not work out for me, boys. This might not work out for me at all. Damn. Well, I gotta take care of business here. Okay, yeah, he's in trouble. It's this 40 Vader's pretty good though, I gotta say. But I think I got this. Man, he killed all my backup. But, let's see. I think I should be okay. No, got to get it off. Yeah, there we go. Wow, well played by that guy, though. Let's see, who was that? You played me twice, Mr. Dan321. What did you play, man? I don't, I, I have to be, uh, be honest, I don't remember. Yeah, I play on a tablet, not an iPad. It's a um, an Asus, um, oh shoot, ZenPad S3 10-inch tablet. It's basically an iPad Air 2. I don't play on an emulator. Which I think a lot of like high-level players usually play on emulators. Because you get a little bit more precision, but I just like playing on an iPad or on a, on a tablet. I feel like it's how the game was meant to be played. This guy's keeping me waiting. Still haven't lost all night with my Han, guys. And probably like, I don't know. 12 games or so. Watch me jinx myself against this boss. He's running Dewback. I do not like to go straight into a Dewback with my Bantha if I can help it. So I'm just going to stream from the back here. Let's see if I can get some favorable trades. Uh-oh. The net the net is overpowered. Oh no. Wow. Oh, uh, my partisan has to do work. Oh my god, guys, look at that. Oh no. Oh no. Man, that was almost a total disaster. Yeah, he actually kind of outplayed me right there. Oops, I did not do that right. Man, this guy's playing well. Look at that. Gotta use both my health packs. Uh, I'll save that one, actually. But here we go. I finally got my Bantha. He's gonna have a tough time pushing into this lane now. Hmm. 
got to remember he's running, um, oh man, kill it, he's running TIE Bomber, which he's probably going to use on me right here, man, this guy's pretty good, showing me what's up with boss, that's for sure. Whoops. Alright, the only way I'm going to win this game is if I get a really big nasty push going in this guy's face. Double Bantha. This is it, boys. This is the dream. No! No! The push has failed, boys! The push has failed! Alright, I got one more shot here. Wow, that was a pretty epic game, actually. Uh, see you later, Harry, you. Alright guys, one more game. One more game to fill up my packs for the night. So I can have them unlocking until tomorrow-ish. So, so far I have like all wins and two draws with Han. Sand Trooper. I think I got this guy, guys. Not that he can't recover from this, but this is not a good start for him. Especially if I get this kill right here. Oh yeah. This guy's in trouble. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man, I might have spoken too soon. That nerve gas. Man. That was quite the turnaround he had there. I still like my chances though. Get them, boys. Nah, they didn't do it.
Hold off. Hold him off, boys. Oh no, here he comes. Oh, that was so close. He's low, though. No! Oh my god, I just can't get a win. Gotta go hard in the paint here, boys. It's the only way. Oh, oh I got him. Phew! That was a good game. Good game to end it on right there. See you, Matt B. Well, that was a pretty good, pretty good follow-up to that boss game. But yeah, I agree. I would like to play that boss again. He was pretty good. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the stream. I had fun tonight, actually. This was a good round. Um, I will probably play again tomorrow night. I'm not sure. Um... Stay tuned, but I uh, hope you guys have a good night. May the force be with you. Um, hope you guys have some good games. And I hope you guys, uh, you know, find my stream useful. Um, uh, I like to interact with you guys. I think it's a lot of fun. And that's that's kind of why I've stopped doing, like, the pre-recorded videos and stuff, is I like the uh, the interaction. So, yeah, take it easy, guys. Night.